What's up guys, Mr. Lee Redman here. Welcome to a new series on my channel. Uh, I am still carrying on with the Real Oviedo file. Um, I should hopefully be loading up some soon. Um, I think I'm going to have that file and this one as my main two to the end of the FM 2013 when we get FM 14. Which uh, is almost three weeks away from this current viewing um, so hopefully I uh, I'll just carry on with these two basically till it's actually come out um, already have two series in mind for 2014 uh, one is with Sleem actually um, so hopefully in in this one basically I just want to get Sleem uh, just back to where he should be Champions League and all that um, and obviously into Europe is my main name initially and then hopefully getting into Europe and the Champions League and possibly getting further in on that one and I will carry on even if I do get a sight of Sleema, this I will carry on until then um, with that in mind I have actually loaded up a load as you can see a load of the um, lesser nations so we've got Albania, Andorra, Armenia, Azerbaijan, Bosnia, Estonia, Faroe Islands, Macedonia, Georgia, Kazakhstan Latvia, Lithuania, Luxembourg, Malta, Moldova, Montenegro and San Marino and uh, I'll just carry on going around all of those until uh, FM, FM 14 comes out um, where I'll then basically finish there depending on what we're doing um, so in this case we are Sliema Wanderers the reason I've actually chosen them is I've actually just come back from Malta on a week's holiday um, was um, just looking through like uh, all round I had heard of Sleema anyway I do actually now have a scarf which I managed to buy I was looking for a shirt but I managed to, I've got a scarf instead um, almost went and watched them actually with my dad but um, we didn't in the end I was going to watch them against Floriana I think it was um, but yeah we'll get into the details now um, to be fair there isn't that much as you can see the defense isn't that great um, I'm trying to find players but as expected basically the um, Maltese football is just shocking it is pretty much just um, semi-pro teams if that um, in the Premier League itself I've not quite got the actual league set up as it should be um, this should be basically they play each team twice and then once that's done uh, it gets split top six go into a championship playoff and the bottom six will go into a relegation playoff where they'll play each other two more times um, I can never get those playoffs working so I've just taken the easy option in this case and just made it so that they're playing each team three times um, so hopefully my main aim, my aim in the first season is to kind of even out, um, consolidate a little bit. But I would really like to get into Europe because um, of how bad Maltese football is. Uh, the top team qualifies for the Champions League and normally starts, or in this case, will start in the first round. But the second season, they actually go to the second qualifying round, and they are one of the lowest ranked teams in the whole tournament. And then second, third, and fourth go into the Europa League depending on the winner of the actual cup um, I'm not actually going to do that much at the moment transfer center I've not brought anyone in um, I've managed to sell one player but that's it uh, Roman Galabev who went to Dingley Swallows I think is, is that what I called yeah, Ding yeah Dingy, Dingley Swallows um, I've got my tactics all sorted I've played some friendly so we'll have a look at those actually paid um, Marshallock and lost 3-2 Sean Bajada and Ian Zamet scored for me uh, it was 2-2 two, two at half time so the uh, unfortunately conceded in the last minute I think it was to give Marshallock a 3-2 win uh, we drew no one there with St. Patrick um, slight injury to Seri but it's not, it's not actually that bad that's my first fault we have a feeder club in Legia Athletic, I think is what they're called. Yeah, Legia Athletic. We won 3 1. Joseph Mifsud, Ivan Woods, and Jeremy Annie scoring for me. And then the final one was against 
Zerbuja, I think is how you say it, and Ivan Woods and Pablo Gonzalez scored two goals for me. Um, that is pretty much it, guys. So it's just a quick run through of what's going on. Um, what I'm actually going to do is actually have a quick look at Europe and how the Maltese clubs got on, because um, it is quite I quite enjoy looking at how some teams get on. Um, so we're going to the first round. Um, so we have. Let's see if I can find them. Oh. So there's all three. Floriana, who lost two one to Croatia's Osijek, which isn't that bad to be fair, especially as they actually won one of the legs by looks of it. The second team, Burka Kara, lost five two on Agriota Murat 05. And the other ones is Hibernians, who lost three one. Jugadina. So all Maltese clubs went out in the first round, which is no surprise. In the Champions League, they didn't actually do too badly. Valletta won 4 0 against B36 Toshan of Faroe Islands. Um, they are one of the seed. They were one of the seeded teams in this section, so they really should have gone through. Second qualifying round. As you can see, they drew Maribor from Slovenia and actually won 3-2 on aggregate, which is a really good result because they never seem to get further than that. And then in the final, in the third qualifying rounds, they've been drawn against Basel and lost the home leg 2-0. Um, they're just pretty much certain they're not going to get any further. Though to be fair, I wouldn't have expected to um, beat um, Maribor to be quite honest. So they've not done too badly. Um, but that's it pretty much for this episode guys i will come back to you after we've played the floriana game so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven floriana um, i'm going to do updates after each section so it'll be when i've played each team once and then again and then the third and final time after the leagues are done um, the Maltese Cup has been drawn, but I don't think I actually arrive in the Cup until the um, second round. First round takes place in a week's time, actually, um, spread over a couple of days. So hopefully we can get through there. Um, but that's it, guys. Leave some likes, leave some comments, and tune in next time um, for the first section of the league. So take it easy guys and I'll see you later on.